<laughs> okay, so we have Finland. Broadway. Broadway sour cream and onion. Alright. It tastes like ruffles, but sour cream and onion flavor. Sweethearts. It's a corn snacks with nacho cheese flavor. And it's so cute because look. It's actually shaped like little hearts. I don't know. Aw, how cute. Hey. Mm. It tastes like those Lay's like pop chips. I don't like them. What else? Let's see. Okay, so I think this is a gummy. It's Moomin Fruit Candies. Moomin. Yeah. It's not the best. I don't know. Tyrexic. Tyrexic. Pepper. I don't think you know. That's what it is. It's like a hard candy and it's hot and sour. So let's see. Here. Try the blue one. Ooh, don't smell too good either. Mm -mm. I'm so sorry. That was freaking disgusting. I just sat it in my mouth and I was just like, eh. you get this, like, I know it says hot and sour, but I didn't expect it for it to be nasty hot tasting. I don't know what that was. That tastes like it came from like, it tastes, it tastes like hot sauce that came from the ground. I don't know, it just tastes like dirt. It was nasty. Susu, original. Looks like one. Mm. Mm. Okay. I was right. So, it tastes like a crunch bar mixed with caramel. This is actually really freaking good. And now we have Jim. Looks like there's marshmallow in here. Nope. Mmm. Oh my god. That's not marshmallow. I can't even put my nose on that smell. That's incredible. That's incredible. That that's not it's definitely not marshmallow. Um I don't even know of something To describe it to you, because it's such an incredible taste. It looks like marshmallow, but then it's not. The sweetness intensity of it actually tastes like like passion fruit or something. But it's white, and it looks like marshmallow. Here, let me shake. I just got to shake this. Cause... Do you guys see that? See, it looks like marshmallow, but it's not. It tastes like passion fruit. I don't know. I don't know. It just tastes amazing. That's all I know. It tastes amazing. That's really freaking good. That's a huge one. Top, topla, tupla, tupla maybe, tupla. I don't know. I, oh no. 
this looks like 100 grain bar, whatever it's called, that one in the red packaging. Mmm. No. No. Mm -mm. No, no. Um, <laughs> definitely not. That 100 gram bar, whatever it's called, 1,000 gram, 100 gram, whatever. Definitely not that. This looks like a pack of cigarettes. Remember how back in the 90s, the early 90s, we had that cigarette candy? That's what this packaging reminds me of. But I know it's not that, <laughs> which is disappointing to be honest. Look, it even opens up like a little pack of cigarettes too. But it's not that. But it's so disappointing. All right, let's see. Oh, okay. It smells like it smells like gummy raisins. Mm 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 mm. I don't know. That was gross. I wouldn't even feed this to Cody. Like, that's nasty. <sighs> okay. Uh, Carl Phaser? Phaser? I don't know. It's not bad chocolate. It just tastes like chocolate that should be melted down in a cup and like made with hot chocolate or something. That's the type of chocolate it tastes like. I don't know. So next, ooh, this just seemed like something that should be in Japan or something. Or, no, China, sorry. <laughs> Excuse me. Kesha. Kesha. Look at the packaging on this. Look how cute this is. I mean, it has cherry blossoms on it. It's pink, it's cute. Oh, oh, okay. So this one gets me more details. Some milk chocolate with soft hazelnut filling. That sounds good. So I think we're in for a treat. Mmm. Mmm. That is very pleasant. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Ferro. Or Ferrero. Fer 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 How are you pronounce it? Those American little balls of hazelnut and milk chocolate. That's what this tastes like, but in a candy bar. Looks like it has an orange on it, so hopefully it's like some sort of like citrus drink. I don't know, but it's called Jaffa. Two hours later. That's right, orange, okay. Maybe this is like an orange soda. Uh-huh. That's that's a that's okay. It's decent. It tastes like a lighter version of American orange soda without all of the artificial flavoring. Like it still tastes unhealthy, don't get me wrong. But it just tastes like it has real oranges in it instead of artificial oranges. Just saying. But it's actually pretty decent. Okay, so let's recap. Okay. Alright, so the susu, the gym. The Geisha and the Broadway, I give it all 10. They were really freaking good. I'm impressed. Now for the items that I rate zero on because it's so nasty. Like, oh, no. You know what's lower than zero? Negative numbers. Negative infinity. So we got the Tupla. That's really gross. That's negative. Um, and then you have the... <coughs> Oh, excuse me. And then we have the Tarisk Pebbler. I don't know. Pe pepper. There's no L in it, so pepper. And then the Salmikai. Salmikai. The things that were deceiving and looked like candy cigarettes, but it wasn't. I all give that negative. And for everything that was decent, the drink, Jaffa, that was decent. And then you have the Carl Fazer, 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 whatever, Moomin, and then the Hearts. 
these were all decent. They were good. Overall, <laughs> this one was the most interesting because there's not there was quite a few things that was disgusting. So I was just like, oh, you didn't try anything. But what do you think? You just want some? You just want some. That's all. Are you mad at mama? Are you mad at me? <laughs>